path of knowledge there is this big question about qualifications if you enter the path of knowledge they will say sadhan chatushtaya sampanna pramata adhikari which means which is as as uh, difficult as it sounds which which means the person with fourfold qualifications is uh, qualified for vedanta what are the fourfold qualifications one that the discrimination between the real and the unreal viveka vairagya the dispassion for the unreal and uh, an intense desire to reach the real and the six fold treasures calmness of the mind control of the sense organs uh, withdrawal from the world a settledness samadhan settledness in, inside in brahman uh, and then um, fortitude spiritual fortitude putting up with all the difficulties in the world in the pursuit of spiritual knowledge a uh, deep faith in the teachings of the of the vedanta of the guru and so on and mumukshutvam intense desire to be free now how many of us have got those things how many of us have got those qualifications but in bhakti what is the qualification nothing nothing anybody can start in the path of bhakti anybody can enter the path of bhakti anybody can start the difference is like this knowledge gyana is like a king you need to decorate your house you need to clean up the, before you invite the king to your house you need to clean up the house you need to you know decorate it nicely and get a probably order a new sofa set or something because the king is coming and um, you know perfume and spray and uh, and dress up nicely everything should be perfect before the king will even deign to come in and when the king comes in there the king doesn't do anything just goes and sits down royally because this is the king he goes down and sits down on the throne couch potato so <laughs> but on the other hand bhakti the the uh, word bhakti the sanskrit word is feminine so um it's compared to a humble maid servant a maid servant who doesn't want any preparation you you can you just she just says let me into your house a house let me into your heart that's all i want and once you let her in bhakti what she does is she comes and cleans up your house you don't have to do anything she cleans it up bhakti brings in its train all the good qualities all the virtues so love of god comes and cleans up your house decorates your house so um so that is the advantage of bhakti anybody anybody is qualified to love god 